Welcome to Gotham City's Arcade. I'm your host, GCA. I'm here with another with another segment of Here's My Two Cent. It's something I'm going to start up, something new, something hood. My grandmother used to tell you, let me tell you two cent. So I figured let me just play it in this. So My Two Cent is about the time crisis cabinet that is going to appear very shortly on the shores of the United States. And I basically am excited about the cap. I we, we definitely got the renders. Now we know what it looks like. Uh, shout out to Kongs, uh, 19K Fox, Michael B, uh, P Dubs, and the rest of the community for basically showing the games list, showing the cabinet, and whatnot. However, for me personally, I think 750 is a lot of money for a cabinet. I think everybody in the community should wait to see what the first sale looks like. And if not, go into the new year and wait. We definitely need this cab to come down a couple of hundred dollars. I think 750 is a high price cab. I think somewhere around 600 to 650 would have been more, more lucrative to everybody in the community. But I think 750 and then with tax, you're paying almost 840, 850 for this cabinet. I think it's highway robbery. So let's look at the video that is definitely why I think what I'll tell you my point of view after the fact. Now you see that you know it has the four games, time crisis, point blank, still gunners, still gunners too. And you know, I, I think the cabin looks really good. Uh, the sending the sending guns that come with it is not that great based on what Kong showed for the cab. I honestly don't feel that like this cab is worth the amount of money that everybody that the retailers think it definitely deserves. I, I don't feel that that cab is worth all that kind of bread. It's just it's a lot. It's a lot to ask for with this kind of inflation going on right now. It just don't make sense. And my thing is 750 is highway rock. Being that the guns are not sending sending tech and some kind of generic, generic kind of gun with plastic pieces inside after Kongs had displayed it. I think everybody should wait and hold up. Let's see what Black Friday shows. Let's see what Christmas show. Let's see what happens at the New Year's. If this price do not come down to at least six hundred dollars, I don't think this is not a worthwhile cap. For me personally, I was I was gonna go and pull the trigger for it, but then after watching a few of the reviews that's out there, I don't think this is the cap for anyone to basically basically pull the trigger or basically say, "Let me not pay my rent." So at this point. Of junction, I cannot recommend this cabinet as of right now. Maybe in a few months, when the price comes down, then I will say, Yes, let's go and empty our pockets and get it. But right now, RK One Up and the retailers like Walmart, Best Buy, GameStop, Target, whoever is that's going to promote this cab, I feel like 750 is not worth the price point. So at this point, thumbs down all the way down across the board for them. So that is my two cent from Gotham City's RK. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to the channel. Please leave your comments below. And this is the end of my video. Peace.